Man said mentoring for what? Personal development and that. So basically, when I have like these mentoring sessions and that, yeah, I get the people them, what do you know? Yeah, I was gonna say boys and girls, but yeah, just demand them to tell me about their life and that. And I just basically give them pointers where they, they're going wrong or what they can do better and that. I had a guy the other day telling me that his girlfriend wanted him to uh, move in. Like, they, she, I don't know, maybe she wanted them to, to go and rent somewhere together. I was saying, do not do that under any circumstances. Because what's going to happen is you're living at your parents' house right now. So his situation, he's living at his parents' house right now. He doesn't have to pay rent. Yeah. He's got a little agreement with his parents. Cool. He don't have to pay rent. But even if he had to pay 250, yeah, that's still good. I said to him, first and foremost, don't even move out and buy your own property and live there. Yeah. If you're going to buy a property, buy a buy to let property. Yeah. But because when you move out of your parents' house and that, now you're taking on unnecessary bills. Forget about the girl. We'll go, I'm going to talk about that in a sec. But if you move out of your parents' house and get your own property, like you own it, yeah, you have to pay gas, water, electric, council tax, all these bills that you wouldn't need to pay at your parents' house. Yeah? You've got to make that sacrifice, your independence and your, you know what I'm trying to say, your pri private life and that. You've got to make that sacrifice. In that. So that's just with him. And that's me just talking from the aspect of people going out of their way to go and own their own property. Forget about boyfriend, girlfriend business. Forget about that. I was saying to him, you and this girl, yeah, better not go and do not go and rent no property with or whatever, or even buy a house with this girl, yeah? Because what's going to happen is two, three years down the line, you lot are probably going to break up and that's it, yeah? And all of those bills, yeah, every month, multiply that by every... So let's say, for example, bills come up to like three, four hundred pounds every month, yeah, or a thousand pounds every month. Multiply that by the months that you that you're gonna occupy this new property for 36 months, 24 months, we're looking at three years, two years, and that when the relationship goes down the drain, all of that money you spent gone, gone with nothing in return. You're gonna, I said to him, you're gonna go back home with broke pockets and a fucking and a, and a broken heart. Yeah, your ego is gonna be damaged and your heart's gonna be broken. Yeah, so. I, any any of the man that watching this right now, do not move in with no fucking girl, blood. Do not move in with no girl. You're wasting your money, fam. Don't get no girls pregnant as well before the age of 28, 30 years old. 